The subfix arthrorhesis implant from striker foot and ankle is intended to treat the hyperpronated foot and stabilize the subtalar joint. It is intended to block forward, downward, and medial displacement of the talus, thus blocking excessive pronation and the resulting sequela. Manufactured from medical grade titanium, the subfix arthrorhesis implant features a conical, anatomically conforming shape that is finely threaded medially and tapers into a wider, smooth lateral surface. Five size offerings ranging from 6.5 to 11.5 are supported with procedure-specific instrumentation. A 1 to 3 centimeter incision is placed within the relaxed skin tension lines of overlying sinus tarsi. Once the skin is incised, the deep fascia should be opened with a blunt ringed instrument, i.e. hemostat, and penetrated into the sinus tarsi. A linear incision is made over the lateral sinus tarsi. The 2.0 mm cobalt chrome implant rod is inserted into the sinus tarsi until the implant rod is felt at the medial aspect of the hind foot. A trial sizer is placed over the implant rod and inserted into the sinus tarsi. Clinical exam should reveal normal hind foot motion. If the hind foot is too stiff, a smaller trial should be selected and clinical exam repeated. Likewise, if pathologic motion or undercorrection remains, a larger size trial should be selected and clinical exam repeated. Positioning should be evaluated via intraoperative imaging, both AP and lateral, and referenced via the markings on the trial handle. Following trial implant removal, the appropriate implant is selected and attached to the driver handle. The driver handle is used to place the implant according to both the markings on the handle as well as radiographic verification. As with trial implant insertion, hind foot motion and degree of deformity correction should be assessed clinically to verify adequate correction. The wound should be irrigated and closed in layers according to the surgeon's preference. 